Hey everyone, it's a very exciting couple of days coming up in America. Aside from a National Sandwich Day and a National Donut Day fast approaching, it's also a massive midterm election on Tuesday. I looked on Google and apparently Sunday the 4th is actually National Common Sense Day. But rest assured that will all be long forgotten when people on both the right and the left go to the polls to vote in a two-party system where a brutal combination of districting voter suppression and an electoral system about as honest as pure as Morgan mean that in the end everything will likely be decided upon by the votes of just a handful of people in key districts. Which of it sounds familiar is because it is. In the UK it's the same method as how Arlene Foster determines on a day-to-day -day basis whether Theresa May is the Prime Minister or not. My favourite expression in politics is the tyranny of the status quo. And for all the talk of blue waves or millennial voters, I really don't think anything major is going to happen, frankly. Elections are always decided by swing voters, so really this midterm comes down to the question of whether or not anyone's changed what's left of their mind since 2016. If, for instance, you're a Democrat voter, you need to reflect back on whether you've used your charm and persuasion over the past two years to convince some Trump voters to switch to your side. I imagine that entrenched voters are frankly as likely to switch as I am to order a vegetarian roast in a pub. Do not be mistaken, this election will entirely be decided upon by who gets closest to 100% of their core voters to turn out to vote on Tuesday. The thing is that outside of the voter base, is a lot of people frankly don't care about the Mexican border or transgender rights in schools, although they do care a lot about potholes and whether those schools are working air conditioning or not. America might not have a third party, but it does have don't know, don't care, and that's a bigger party than a lot of people on both sides are willing to admit. There's possibly a lesson in there for other countries too. Anyway, see you next week. Like to click subscribe.